welcome into a new video, guys. I'm not wearing very much Christmas stuff right now, but I am wearing something very, very nice. A Blue Holtz Brownies hoodie, guys. So, you probably clicked on this video looking for the gingerbread, the giant gingerbread man or woman. So, it's 2022, giant gingerbread man or woman. Um, however, that is later on in the video. We have something that my sister got me. Look at this massive Rice Krispie. This thing is huge, so that's what she said. So we're gonna dive into this. Thank you for clicking on today's video. You guys are the best. Love getting all the love of you guys watching the videos. So it's rainbow uh, non parallels. I uh, don't know what that is, but this thing is huge. I don't know how I'm going to bite into it. Ooh, the stickers stick into it. However, look at that. A big block of Rice Krispies, baby. Holy smokes. Mmm. Oh, <laughs> my poor jaw. Guys, this is officially the last Christmas video of 2022. I mean, look at how it's thick with three seeds. There's a Corvette in front of me. It's parked in two car parking spots. Don't be that person. That's crazy. How many calories are in this thing? 180 times 4. Seven hundred and twenty calories. I just got done squatting. Post workout fuel. I'm going to dislocate my jaw trying to eat this. So good. <laughs> Team Rice Krispies, baby. I'm going to stop that. Man, this is really good. Shout out to my sister. So besides the gingerbread, I got a few things planned in mind for this video. Last bite, baby. Welcome into a new video guys. Thank you for clicking on the video. We got this massive Rice Krispie that my sister got me. Super delicious with the rainbow sprinkles on top. So ladies and gents, on the next part of the agenda, we're off to Target. I know Target's gonna be horrendous. It's Christmas, like the week before Christmas. So, <sighs> my jaw is seriously tired, but I'm off to Target guys. Let's go see the chaotic Target. Cause I gotta get some goodies. Now I know what you're thinking, you're probably thinking, this is clickbait, there's no giant gingerbread man. Well it's not clickbait, he's cooling down right now, or she. So uh, ginger, gingerbread is cooking, well it's already cooked, 
It's just cooling down, guys. Thank you for clicking on the video. We're, you know, you got to keep entertainment coming even while the main course isn't here yet. Um, so this is my version of a Chipotle walking taco. It's uh, Chipotle with double chicken. It has queso. We have uh, medium salsa. We got sour cream. We got Fritos. We got all the goods, guys. I also got with me two of this crumble cookies for this week for like Christmas, I think it's kind of. I think next week's going to be more of a Christmassy one, so I'll probably do it then. However, let's get the show on the road, and we're going to start with some Chipotle, and then we're going to have the main course of this video that you guys seen. If you guys don't want to see that, skip ahead. However, this is our walking taco of the day. It's a very Midwestern thing, but anybody can do it. Fritos, baby. I haven't had Fritos in forever. Mmm. That's sour cream with the, the whole shebang. So guys, I really couldn't hold off until this gingerbread massive gingerbread cookie was done i had to get some to eat so i went with chipotle and i also got crumble cookies now typically walking tacos with ground beef with taco seasoning i'll do that but i was on like a fast version of doing this <laughs> so i just got off of work mm. this is pretty much just chipotle with fritos Have you guys ever had a legit walking taco before? Or did it get away on you? That was corny. This was actually a massive bowl too. I'm really curious about this peppermint chocolate crumble cookie. I'm not a fan of... Well, I like peppermint, but I don't know how it's going to go with chocolate. I do like chocolate, though. Yeah, very skeptical about this peppermint chocolate cookie. I just don't see the two going together. However, you guys will get to see what I think of it in a minute. But this uh, walking taco was super delicious. I put Funyuns at the bottom and then on top. <laughs> so it's the, the holiday season, it's Christmas. Did you guys get all your gifts yet? Or finish all your gift shopping? This is filmed out a week before Christmas and I can't believe Christmas is next week. Dude, Christmas absolutely flew. This whole year has gone fast. It's been crazy. Um, I'm going to be doing one more video after this one for the year of 2022. And it's just mind-boggling that this year is nearly over. We're almost in 2023. It's insane. Mm -mm -mm. If you haven't tried this, I know I don't usually Fritos with my Chipotle bowl. because the calories but this is insane yeah, fun fact, Subway and Chipotle are my go-tos. Uh, also, I'm a big fan of frozen vegetables. I love them, plus they're really low calorie, high volume, so you can eat a ton of them too. If you guys want to see a real walking taco, post in the comments below. Yeah, I'm definitely going to probably do a walking taco challenge. I just want to see if you guys want to see it. Um, but I used to eat them up north after like my football games when I was in high school. Super delicious. Like I said, it's more of a Midwestern. I was born and raised in Michigan. Chipotle balls took me two days to eat. Ah, got stabbed by the chip. 
two of the worst pains is when a chip comes up and stabs you in the gum. Also, same thing as when you stub your toe. Especially if you do the pinky toe. I don't know why, but it hurts more than every other toe. Well, maybe the big toe, too. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Time for the crumble cookies. Let's go with the peppermint chocolate first. Look at that. Excuse me. Whoa. Whoa. It's definitely different. Ooh, very strong peppermint. It's like crushed candy canes on this, man. I really forget the name of this one. It's like caramel nut something. I did this one. Not that I didn't like the peppermint, but definitely different peppermint. <laughs> it's code for it wasn't my favorite, but it wasn't the worst. <laughs> yeah, that is true. It was not my favorite crumble cookie. I've had a, f a lot of crumble cookies that I really do enjoy. This one right here actually tastes just like a Twix bar. I forget the name of it. I wish I could remember, but it tastes exactly like a Twix, guys. It was super delicious. Man, my light over here is dying. <laughs> That one that tastes like a Twix was way better than the peppermint. It wasn't bad, like I said, but it wasn't my favorite. But I'm also not the biggest peppermint fan. I need to clean up some of this to get ready for the gingerbread. Massive gingerbread cookie. Here's what sadly happened to the first gingerbread man. Look as he's cut in half. I went to take a picture and the gingerbread fell. All right, guys, a very sad RIP to Ed Sheeran. That was the name of the last gingerbread man before he broke in half. Ed Sheeran, get it? I hope you get that joke, gingerbread man. Um, but this is uh, this is going to be the new one, guys, because the other one broke in half. Don't worry, he didn't go to waste. Um, I guess I can for my family. So we got the second one. This one's all held together. It looks like kind of just like the last one, but a little more happier. Uh, we're gonna go into the giant gingerbread man part two um, Trying to make this thing because the other one just snapped in half sadly, <laughs> so Sad tragic ending for that guy, but uh, or girl. Well, it's Ed Sheeran, so it's a guy um, But let's go into it guys. This is the gingerbread number two, so let's get this going got some milk on the side now to get my photos too before it broke in half. So, let's dig in. This is the biggest gingerbread man I could ever make. Wow, that's really soft. Look at that. Mmm. The whole leg. Mm. 
Now this is the same gingerbread cookie recipe that I use for my brownies, the gingerbread snickerdoodle. After those crumble cookies and chipotle, this will be a challenge. <laughs> Because the arm nuts. So a lot of cookies. All right, my friends, what you've clicked on the video is here, the giant gingerbread man slash woman slash person. Um, but we are diving into this massive cookie. Green icing was weird. I was a little worried about this because when it came out of the oven, I was like, okay, it looks a little soft. I gave it some time to cool down and harden um, as I do with my brownies. And it actually just held together besides the first one that broke and I had to make a new one. The edges are crispy. I do a giant bunny for Easter. <laughs> oh, so much cookie. We have the left arm. I'm getting kind of gingerbreaded out, but I'm going to take a little bit left. Yeah, guys, I'm going to let you enjoy the rest of the video. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas Eve. As you guys can see, this video is on Christmas Eve. I hope you guys get everything you wish for and more. And I hope you and your family have a wonderful Christmas. And I will catch you guys in the last video of 2022. We mean business. Man, that looks really scary. Just the head left. Still so wrong. Sorry. I'm sorry, come to know, Brian. I hope we get that one too. Getting down to the nitty gritty. This thing was nearly the size of my pan. <laughs> Alright, my name is Keith Buholtz and this is, or was, the biggest gingerbread man I could possibly make. Merry Christmas, happy holidays, don't do this. At home, kids. That milk did help. Oh, man. What a 
meal. <laughs> what a meal. Thank you guys for clicking on this video. Pretty crazy, pretty fun. I always wanted to do a giant gingerbread man slash woman. Man or woman. Um, but yeah. That's all she wrote, folks. Until next time, if you guys want to get some Wilkes Brownies, don't know what flavors will be in right now when you by the time you see this, but if there is some, click on the link in the description, Wilkesbrownies.com. Appreciate your guys' continuous support. You know what? Let's do something. Let's post in the comments something that you're asking for for Christmas. I'm not saying I'm Santa Claus, but just post in the comments, you know, so you can see well, if it's, you know, if you can, if it's appropriate. However, post in the comments what you like for Christmas. I'm out, guys. Until next time. Peace out.